So today's question is, do you take the time to think? So thinking does take time or should take time. So, you know, we live in a very hectic world. We live in this, what I call a society of anxiety in which we have high expectations of ourselves and we have high expectations of others and others have high expectations of us. And so we, we get caught up in this idea about living successful lives, which is hectic, often overscheduled and overwhelming. We could really get into to, to that concept, but the, the point that I'd like to make today is that as we work through the struggles of life, we have to take time to think. You just can't keep pushing, pushing, and pushing without taking a moment to think about the latest struggle. So if, if, if life is, is a struggle and um, in the moment uh, I might say, yeah, I'm between struggles right now, the, the fact is that struggles do uh, invite and, and require thought. So, uh, for instance, uh, in my psychiatry practice, this major insurance billing issue came up this last week. And while on the one hand it, it, it might be a distraction, it's a huge distraction. And uh, it's, it's enough of a, of a problem that, you know, I might lose sleep over it. Actually, I haven't. But there have been times when a struggle will hit and I have to think it through. And what I have done sometimes is, you know, if, if I wake up early, like three o'clock in the morning, and my mind is on, and I, it is on that thing that I'm trying to sort out, I'll get out of bed, go in, make my coffee, sit in my recliner, and think I've got three hours before I have to get ready to go to work. And in that three hours, I'm going to make some significant progress with this. And so I might literally just sit and think for three hours, or I might think until maybe the first cup of coffee is underway, and then uh, come into my office here and start writing things down. So I have found that, that journaling helps to organize my thinking uh, a different version of that is actually starting to to write things down on various pieces of paper. I'll use printer paper and for, for me making a list of thoughts here or making a Venn diagram um, in which I'm, I'm you know kind of again organizing what it is that needs to be organized. It is taking the time to think and so in this very challenging, hectic, anxious world that we live in, don't hesitate to sit down and think through the thing that needs to be thought through. In fact, if you consider yourself to be a high achiever or high performer, I would suggest that that be one of your habits. That when your mind is on something that needs... The, if your mind is, is working on something, it will continue to do that, but you will do it much faster and much more effectively if you just sit down, take the time to think it through.